The overall goal of this procedure is to generate fluorescent protein fusions in candida species by using PCR-mediated gene modification to tag a protein encoding sequence at its native genomic locus, thus ensuring stable integration and expression of sequences over time. This method can be used to generate fluorescently tagged candida strains and proteins, which facilitates their identification and quantitation for both in vitro and in vivo analyses. The main advantage of this technique is that it's fast compared to conventional cloning approaches and offers the potential to screen transformants by colony or individual cell-based fluorescence microscopy. Though this method was initially developed to tag proteins in Canada albicans, it can also be applied to other yeast species such as Canada prapsilosis as described in this protocol. Generally, individuals new to this method struggle to obtain transformants that contain correct cassette integrations into the intended gene locus. This problem can be minimized by optimizing conditions and reagents at each procedure step as highlighted in the protocol. After designing primers according to the text protocol, to prepare 500 microliters of a master mix for PCR, Combine 320 microliters sterile water, 50 microliters of PCR buffer, 20 microliters of DNTPs, 40 microliters of 25 millimolar magnesium chloride, 20 microliters of purified plasmid, 10 microliters of each forward and reverse primers, and 30 microliters of TAC polymerase.